Hello folks and welcome back to Dark Souls 3. As always, of course, I am Falcon, your host, and we are back here at Faron's little, or the wolf's, rather, old wolf of Faron, his bonfire, <clears throat> and his room. There's a, there's a, uh, elevator here, and I want to see where it goes. Now, off camera, I went ahead and got rid of all my hollowing, because I was actually starting to look like a hollow. Um, I, I don't know if this has any actual, like, long-term effect. I know that the Dark Sigils themselves do, uh, but I don't know if the Halloween itself does. So I went ahead and got rid of it just because I'm a little concerned. Uh, you will note also I have a new a new hat, F uh, Ferris's hat. Uh, we also have her bow for those who know what we're talking about, the black bow of Ferris. Uh, this is dropped by those dudes that cast those, that horde of, uh, like, skull summon things. The big dudes that really kind of pissed me off. <laughs> it's dropped by a couple of them that were over in a certain area. I think I got all the items in the level. Uh, I might have missed... No, no, I think I got them all. I thought I had missed this, uh, set. But I think I got everything. I don't think I missed anything. Okay, so we've got... Okay. Uh, Alright. So we have a cat you are laying on the phone that I need to use for my timer. There we go. I think I managed to grab it underneath her butt. Your big old furry butt. It's in the way. She's laying directly underneath the microphone, so if she moves and make noise noise at all, you guys will undoubtedly hear her, for which I apologize. But she's being good. She's just kinda laying there, so I'm gonna leave her alone, but we'll see. Alright, so right now I'm at 270, so this drops me to 175, so I definitely lose damage. However, I lose damage. Okay, so you are what we're contending with here. Where is this? This is not where I thought I was going to end up. Try luring it out and then ranged battle. Alright. You look really scary. Like, really scary. I think you were fighting it. Oh, it apparently picks you up and does something horrifying to you. Alright, well, good to know. Good to know. Well, there's actually stuff on the other side of this. Oh, is this? I think I know where this is. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is on... Okay. This is that bridge that we saw when we first came down to... Uh, off the high wall. Uh, where that dead dragon was, and we met the... Um, <clears throat> I don't remember what the fuck his name was, but the one... Uh, um, the guy who gives me the uh, dark sigils. This is where we met him. This thing kind of scares me. I don't know what it's going to do. I'm a little bit... Cons Are you? By George, I think it is. This may not be a good weapon to use against him, because I don't know. I kind of feel like he's going to be... I only had a brew. I kind of have a feeling he's not going to be vulnerable vulnerable to fire. Fine work. An ember. Yeah, you are! Do you do your old explosion in front of you? This is... Well, he was actually... You've actually fought him multiple times in Dark Souls 1. But this is a boss from Dark Souls 1. There's his little 
Ow. Okay, you were faster on the drop on now than you were in Dark Souls 1. Ooh. Okay. Whoa, what the fuck was that? Okay. Uh. God. No, 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 no. Run, run, run. Okay. Uh, I'm going to straight up retreat for a moment because this weapon is not doing the fire damage. I don't think it's working on him very well, so I'm going to switch to these weapons. Okay, that was some bullshit right there. That totally should not have hit me. Oh lord, how, how far are you going to chase me here, bro? I want to be behind you, please. Or, okay. Or I just don't do damage to you, okay. Okay. No, no, no! Fuck! Oh. Alright. Well. He's interesting. That hurt. Am I still taking Halloween? Okay. Oh. Hi, Cliff. How are you doing? Something down there? No. It's just the end of the world. Just the edge of the world down there. Alright, so... I think I might have been doing slightly more damage with this. But it wasn't a lot. I actually don't know that I can block his attacks. I never really tried. Probably should have. Um, so I don't know if attacking him is actually going to be do me any good. I don't know that it doesn't either, so... Oh, apparently you now aggro on me from a distance. Or maybe not. Well, you're just kind of wandering in circles, because I think you're lost. Alright, so... Can I plink you from a distance? I don't do very much damage to you from back here. But I'll whittle you down a little bit as you approach me, I guess. Whittle you down a little bit as you approach. Alright, so what you're gonna do now would be down here. Like, will you. Will you come. Will you still chase me? What will you do? I'm trying to learn his mechanics. Like, learn his. What does he do? Are you going to. Are you trapped? Are you stuck? Oh, apparently, I missed. No, I totally didn't miss, but apparently I missed. Some bullshit that you uh, look like you could almost hit me, but considering I'm like directly below you, but so that would definitely be able to hit me. Alright, well. Let's not be a complete dick. Let's try to fight him. At least a little bit. Let's actually give him a chance. I do want to whittle him down some, though, because he's definitely very dangerous. Uh, he has a better variety of attacks than the version of him that you fought in the first game. E either version of him that you fought in the first game, as they were both slightly different, but... Actually, no, I think you fought him three times in the first game, now that I think about it. Okay, you cannot apparently dodge that in any way, shape, or form. Nope, that's missed. Okay, you have a tail swipe. That's good to know. Good to know. Good to know you have a tail swipe. All right, well. 
could try my blocking him. I haven't tried to block him at all yet. Or I could just cheese the hell out of him. I don't know that I really want to do that, though, because that is, well, cheesing him. Actually kind of sucks if I don't seem to do more damage than that. There we go. Soul of a stray demon. Oh, so you actually gave me a unique soul. Interesting. Interesting. So does this open the gate? Does the gate open now? What happens? If we approach this, does the gate open? Hey, buddy. You open the gate? No? Is there a way? Aha! Uh, okay. Oh, uh, so you're telling me I didn't even have to fight him to get over here? I'm actually kind of annoyed now. That's okay, I wanted to fight him anyway, but... Apparently, I didn't have to actually fight him to get over here. Yeah, see, there's the dragon that I was thinking of. Oh! What are you? Come back, no! Damn it! Damn it! Fucking come back here, you bitch! Fuck! Ooh, lightning spear. Hi, dead dragon. Yeah, see, we were, we were right there. Damn it. I don't know if those guys respawn or not. Ooh, the dragon crest shield. What shield was that? I don't remember. Uh, what does this one do? Greatly reduces fire damage. Nice. Cool. Uh, it's a parry shield. Uh, I, did, I haven't noticed this before, or didn't didn't uh, didn't say this before. I should say, but last episode, or before last episode, I switched over to using this. The reason I switched over to using this, I was using this before. But if you note, uh, it says weapon skill versus parry on this one. So instead of having the parry ability, uh, like we normally would have. Uh, we actually get to use our weapon skill, whatever that happens to be. Uh oh. Shut up, cat! I'm gonna actually switch back to this because I think I do a little more damage against these things with this. I want time for you guys, I don't care. Fuck. There we go. Hey, right, buddy, what do you want? I love those guys, they're like running against the wall, like, we will come get you! <sighs> you could try and come get me. Unless you improve your skills, though, you are failing horribly at this. What the fuck was that? Okay. Sound like a fireball. Oh, it was this. Uh, idiot. Oh, you idiot. You poor, poor idiot. I don't know why you guys even bother. Because you're wasting your time. Okay, so you don't do anything. Apparently you can't open this gate. That's actually kind of annoying. It's actually kind of annoying. Oh, okay. Hi, buddy! Bye-bye. You have failed. You have failed to hit me, friend. Is there something over there? No. No, there isn't. Alright, so... 
I missed that one. The one uh, bug. I wonder, I don't know if they respawn or not, because the one area that I've encountered one before and missed it, I haven't seen it again. And I looked a couple times. Uh, so I, I don't know if they respawn or not, and that will really suck if they don't. Because I wanted whatever the hell it dropped. Oh well. Well, we've cleared whatever this, this little optional area. It's clearly optional because it doesn't go anywhere. There's nothing fucking here. And that little, that demon dude did not drop very many souls. I was hoping he would drop a lot more than he apparently did. Because I only have 8,000 now. Nobody else up there dropped any souls, I'm sure. So... The 8,000 I have are basically from him. <clears throat> and that means he didn't drop anything to speak of. I'm gonna go look real quick, because I want to see if that, uh... If the bug respawned. If it did, I want to get it, but... I don't know that it did or not. I do kind of like the look of my character, and I like this hat. This hat is... was one of my favorite hats in the, uh... the first game. I don't know if it was in the second game, I don't remember. It probably was, but okay, so the demon doesn't respawn. So there's that, if nothing else. If nothing else, the demon dude does... oh, do not fall off of there. That would be very bad. If nothing else, the demon does not respawn, so that's a good thing, at least. All the dudes up top. Don't care about them. Is the bug back? I don't see it. But it was the one that was further away. Yeah, I don't see him. Fuck! Really? They don't respawn in this? Oh man, that is harsh. I guess that's why they're a little easier to catch than they were most of the time in previous games, but that is harsh that they don't come back. That's quite enough of you. I don't want to fight them. I have no reason to fight them. They don't do anything, so y'all don't give me anything, so there's no reason for me to fuck with you. Yeah, that is, that is obnoxious. I am not, not pleased about that. I wanted whatever that was. So I've missed two of the bugs now. The crystal lizards, or whatever. I guess they're lizards, not bugs. I'm calling them bugs because they kind of look like a beetle or something, but I, they're actually lizards. So I've missed two of them. That is obnoxious. But, oh well. Um, apparently, I did look up, apparently the item that you get for, that you need to upgrade that covenant, the wolf covenant, is actually not um, a PvP item. It is an item that you can get randomly from these guys. Among others, but... Uh, the... These guys and the guys like them actually are the ones that drop the item. Which is really strange to me. That it's a covenant... Ostensibly a... PvP covenant that... Um... That your upgrade items for the covenant are actually dropped by... Monsters instead of... Getting them from PvP stuff. Which is, it, that is really, it's really odd to me that they elected to do that. Uh, so I got the, the hat and the black bow from those, uh, where are they? Those guys right there, you can see them right there. Uh, right in front of me there, them. Got it from them. And if we look over here, you can see a crab. I think I did make note of the crab at the very end of the last episode. Uh, well, did the crab respawn? Is the crab gone? Don't actually, yeah, there it is. Um, that crab dropped um, this one. Extends the length of spell effects. 
Uh, and then over there, there was there was a white tree, like the the one tree that the that one giant throws the spears at. If you go near it, or if, if enemies go near it. Um, and we also got this that was right next to that tree. And this uh, is buffs your magic, but you take more damage from magic. Um, I got uh, a couple other things over there, but nothing like super interesting. I think that was basically it. I don't think there was anything else really to speak of. So this time, we're going into here. I don't have any idea what to expect in here. Uh, I haven't been in here yet. I didn't come in here, intentionally didn't come in here. Oh, it's those winged dudes from the, uh, earlier. Those winged guys that I didn't like. What well, striving to them. There's a bunch of you too. Okay, apparently I'm stuck. Alright, so let's see, can we go up here and take out the one that's already transformed, the one that's like the saucer? Because he agitates the others. As well as him being up here is just going to make it more difficult to deal with if we don't contend with him first. Uh, come down here was bad. Coming down here was bad. Okay, apparently you're just going to ignore me. But if you guys just want to ignore me, I'm okay with that. Because I will happily kill you all. I have no issue with just killing you guys. If you're just going to ignore me. I thought you would try to fight me, but... Are you an enemy? Yeah, okay. Okay, so I guess these guys only get up to try to fight you if you piss off the, the wing, the one that was already transformed. <clears throat> Unless maybe you go deeper into the area, like if you ignore them, maybe they'll come after you if you go a certain distance. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything actually up here, so I guess the whole reason to come up here was to kill that guy was to kill the winged one before he pissed the others off. Before he triggered the others into attacking you. Oh, this might go... I don't know, I guess it doesn't yet. This might go to where those items that I was trying to get that were up there, that the one area that you could kind of roll and almost get to them. This might actually go to there, to those. Ooh, what's going on over there? fighting already going on over there? What the hell's going on? Oh, is that a Dark Wraith? I think it's a Dark Wraith. I don't know that I want to fuck, up, fuck with that. Just yet. Anyway. Well, at the same time, it might be dangerous to not kill him. Because he might follow me. He might follow me and try to come after me if I don't fight him. But that's interesting that he was fighting the others. He was fighting the, uh... The regular monsters. Control. Oh shit, there's two of them? Oh Christ. Try playing dead. Yeah, about that. Okay, so they patrol. Okay. Yeah, okay. You were looking this way, so you were trying to fight them. You were definitely trying to fight them when you got killed. Darts. Spirit? What? No skeleton to hit. Alright, so there's a bonfire. Cool. Um. Okay. I guess that kind of begs the question, uh... I have no reason to sit at the bonfire because I, I still have full flasks and everything, so there's no reason for me to fiddle with that. I'm trying to. I'm gonna try and lure just one of these guys. If 
fact, lure just one of them. Yeah, it looks like I can. I can lure one at a time. <clears throat> Which is definitely a better idea than trying to fight them both. Because trying to fight them both at once would be very bad. Alright, buddy. I have a better idea of how to fight you than I did that first time that we, I ran into one of you. I don't want to hit that because I think it's more than just a shield. I think it does something. Ow. Well, you hit me. You did a fair bit of damage too when you hit me, but... He has still lost that exchange because you died and I lived. Okay, so there's a doorway over there. Pretty sure there was only two of these guys, so I should be okay to move in and engage you now. Oh shit, I hear something beat to the beside me. Is there another one? No. I guess not. I don't know what I heard. Well, that was fucking close. Realize that was a combo. Didn't realize that was a combo. Wasn't expecting that to be a two hit thing. Okay, got to, got to uh, see, I can hit him after that. I need to just keep the one hit side to one hit things, I think. So one, and okay, you didn't follow through. So that was why, that was why I was expecting that to be a one hit, because every time I've seen him do it before, it was a one hit. Okay, do your, do your other. And you're dead. Cracked red eye orb, cool. Bunch of items, there's enemies or something over there, I think. A rotten grew carved curved sword. Uh okay. Choice weapon of the blood horn grew's descendants, the acolytes of Farron Keat. Rancid blade is dressed in the, is drenched in a rotten waste, making it acutely poisonous. Interesting. So it is a poison based weapon by default. Which is interesting. Oh, you're the fucking poison spewing one kind. Fuck you. Fuck you and your poison. Okay, so you weren't even guarding anything, so I don't know what the hell you were there for. You were just kind of there. Whatever. I don't know what the hell the point of you even was in that case, because... I was like, oh, you must be guarding an item or something. Nope, nope, he's just fucking there for no reason. Okay, so there's definitely dudes there. I'm gonna ignore you for the moment, because I don't want... That really looks like a... something. A tree. Looks like something. It's apparently not. What the hell am I hearing? Oh, really? What the hell am I hearing? Well, I think this is the boss. Actually. I'm pretty sure this is the boss. Which means I think it's the boss that we're hearing. Oh, we usually die after two hits. Apparently not that time. See, they keep uh, dropping Titanite shards, but they're not dropping the uh, other thing that I really wanted. Spear and grew shield. Cool. Night ahead. Oh, now the real fight begins. If only I had an ally. We can actually get an ally if I so choose, but I don't want to fight the boss just yet. I didn't realize that that was the boss. 
Didn't realize that was the boss. I thought the boss was the other direction. So I actually want to go see what the other stuff is first. Why do I have the fucking sword? The uh, bow out. Don't want the bow out. Did not mean to have the bow out. No joy ahead. I don't know, there's a bonfire. Go out some joy. I'd call that some joy, at least. Okay... Is there something here? Yeah, I think that takes us to where those items are. Yep, it does. Let's not go there just yet, though. No, no, no! None of that. I think the uh, two-handed attack actually does not do... Thanks, game, for almost fucking me there. We decided to change targets. Oh! Okay, I'm gonna go back to this, because I'm more used to this weapon. Um... Well, actually, I think I know what this is. I think I know what this is. This is a shortcut, I believe. This is a really fucking terrible place to fight you. This is a really terrible place to fight you. I don't even know that I can avoid... Yeah, this is just a really bad place to fight you. This is not... This is not a place that you want to be fighting one of these guys. Ooh, I don't even know how the hell I avoided that. You were really easy to kill, though. Like, you were the easiest of all of them that I have fought so far to kill. I was almost disappointed how easy you were. Ooh, great magic weapon. Cool. Alright, so this takes us... I know precisely where this is. Oh shit, I woke him up. Fuck. Don't want to fight you. Don't want anything to do with you. You I don't like. Anyway, um, I don't think you guys ever saw this, because I don't think I showed you. Uh, but there is a Black Knight right there. He's right there. On the other side of that Black Knight, because that was in that episode that I lost when I first fought the one boss, the uh, Crystal Sage. Um, what, did I, what was behind the Black Knight? I don't remember. Well, one thing that was behind him was the uh, Cell Sword armor was back there. For that matter, these... Uh, the uh, cell sword weapons, the cells, my twin blades, were back there too, I believe. Uh, I don't remember what else was back there. I kind of want to fight him so I can show you guys, but then again, I don't really want to fight him because I hate him. he's tough. You just apparently you're just stupid. Oh, you can come through there, alright. I was gonna say, can you not come through there or something? Apparently you can, you just... Really... Oh, shit! Is indeed how we get to these items. I don't know what these are. 
Toad Mint. All right. And what's this one? A Hollow Gem. Interesting. Uh, perfectly honest, I have no particular desire to engage in anything that we will run into if we continue this direction, so I'm going to use a Homeward Bone. Oh, I did not mean to go back to the shrine, but whatever. I have enough souls to level up, so it's kind of worthwhile. And I want to go fight the boss this episode, so even though we're running past uh, where I would have ended... Hello again. Hi. Where I have since from? heard a great deal about you. For one, cool. that you are most gentle of heart. Oh. I too am bound okay. by duty, but can offer you my sign. I hear sure. that cordial intrusion lays the path to embers. If I can be of help, by all means, do call upon me. Blessing of the moon upon your journey. Blessing of the moon. Dark moon. If you should acquire a blessing of the moon. Interesting. Hmm. Gaining admission to the Legion. Inside their keep, snuffing out the flame. Right, no, I already know. I already know about that. We've 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 been there. We've killed that. Been there. Killed that. Uh. Apparently, the dried finger thing. Um. You need in order to be able to summon the dark spirit occur earlier. Apparently this increases the chances of you being both invaded, but also allows you to summon additional people. Even though it says the summoning of a third phantom, I think you can only summon one without it. Because when I had that one guy summoned, like I couldn't see any of the other summon signs, like they all disappeared. That might have been because we were invaded at the same time, so maybe the fact that there was already one person in the, my world. Uh, he was an invader, but Ashen. that might have counted. Maybe? I don't know. Uh, we have a thing to turn into this guy. The mage dude. So let's do that real quick. Oh my. This is stupendous. And the undead legion of Farron possesses sorceries quite unknown. Thank you for upholding your end of the bargain. Yeah. I doubt I ever would have made this discovery alone. Now, let us unravel the thing so you may put these new sorceries to use. <laughs> cool. So what do we get this time? Farron Hale is new. Uh, even though I'm never gonna actually use these, fire on flash sword. That's new. Uh, I think that's it. Still, come again. A couple of new things. Kind of worthwhile, I suppose. Um, there was an item I kind of want to buy from him, even though. I don't know, because I kind of want to use the souls to level up. I'm going to buy the item later. There's actually two items I want to buy from him. I'll go grind the souls for those in a separate Welcome a, a separate instance, but I want to level up here. I actually want to level up here, so I'm going to get uh, a couple more points of that. Oh, really? Oh, it takes a lot. Okay. Uh... All right, maybe I don't want to do that then. All right, so I'll do one point of that and one point in strength because now I have the strength to use the uh, the Zweihander, which I did want to use at some point, at least try it out. That's one of the items I want to buy from the guy. Uh, the other one is another sword. Um, it's a curved sword, maybe. I don't remember what kind of sword it was, but... Uh... Fern 
keep perimeter. Alright, and we are going to go ahead and use a ember, because I do, I think I am going to summon somebody for this fight, just because. I want to see who it will let us summon. Um, I don't want to summon a person, I want to summon NPCs. So obviously these are all probably going to be people. I need to summon Dark Spirits too. Yeah, these are all people. Of varying types. But I want to find the NP the NPC summons. Because we can summon Faris, who we were just talking to. And Oh fuck, those dudes are back again. Can I avoid them? I might be able to just avoid them. Because if we go this way, it might be possible to evade them entirely. Cause I mean they didn't go up and fight the uh dudes who are up here. So I think it's possible to evade them completely. The problem being... The problem is not them, the problem is I don't know. Whoa! Uh, the problem is I don't know if I'll be able to get to the summon signs that I wanted to use without. Because um, I don't know what the summon signs are. See, this is down there fighting, so we'll let them do their thing. You're not a person. Or you're. Oh, no. Oh, what just happened? Lilith, Lapis. Saya, Saya, Tyrone, oh shit. Okay, maybe they will come up here and fight them. Maybe they'll come in after me, I don't know. I don't want to fight these guys, god damn it. On the plus side, you seem to have taken more damage than you took previously. A lot more damage, in fact. Ooh, a pale ton. I didn't know they could drop those. That's cool. I don't remember what I needed that for, but it's cool, nevertheless. Prixor. I'm looking for the NPC summons. I know there's NPC summons here. I just don't know where they are. Oh, the other dark dude died. Oh, there you are. There's one of them. Black Hand Gothard. 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 I don't know how to say his name. That's one of them. Okay, it's just a really shiny rock. <laughs> uh, so, where's, uh, by your sword? Oh, you gave me a, a thing, even. Interesting. Okay, is the other do person even available? I don't see the other person. I don't know. Uh, I do happen to know that using this um, is actually... I'm gonna get rid of the crop of Lombo. I shouldn't need it here. Using this weapon is actually more powerful against these guys, apparently. Yeah, see all these summon signs are gone. So apparently I can only have one person without using the dried finger, which is interesting. Because it says that you need it to summon a third phantom. But, you know, it's strange that we could hear the sound, <clears throat> but uh, nothing's happening in here. Places. Like, we can hear the sound of what sounds like battle or something, but... Oh, okay, there's two of them in here fighting. Why are they fighting? Wow, 
wow, you guys look like fucking something from Bloodborne. Like, a really look like something from Bloodborne. Like that mask, that uh, that hat, that is like Bloodborne armor. Like literally Bloodborne armor. <laughs> if those weapons transformed, you'd look like almost exactly like a Bloodborne dude, but they don't. But if they did, whoa. Surprise! Another one behind me. Okay, yeah, see, some of them will fight each other. The ones with the red eyes, actually, I think the red eyed one is actually the one I need to fight. Maybe not. Unless I'm doing damage when I attack this guy, so maybe not. Maybe the red one, the red eyed one, is the one that is uh, enemy to the others. I mean, obviously, he's an enemy to the others, but maybe that. Maybe he's. he's red eye because he's the enemy to the others. Yeah, see, he has his own health bar, apparently. Well, that was easy. Although, I don't think you're... Are you actually dead? Because I kind of feel like you're not. Yeah. That's what I thought. Say, I kind of feel like you're not dead. I'm pretty sure you're not. Yeah, so now you're gonna transform or do some bullshit, and. Yeah. That's what I thought. Oh, now you're embered up. Interesting. Interesting. Where is he even at? There he is. So do we still have others to fight, or is it just gonna be you and... Oh, alright. Okay. That looks bad. Hey! We got more than one person to deal with here, buddy. I don't want to fucking- HOLY SHIT, you do some damage! Yeah, distract him for me for a second, cuz... How- ouch! <laughs> oh lord, time to leave. Go ahead and heal, I've got plenty of healing potions. Oh, did you just turn invisible? Oh, ow, that hurt. Yeah, I don't think he has... I don't think he has any other... anybody else getting up now. I think it's just the one. Now that one is vastly more dangerous than the other ones were, but than they were earlier. So even though there's only one of them now, he is way more dangerous, but... Damn. I knew that first one wasn't gonna hit, but I was hoping one of the later ones would hit. Got Erd's died. Oh, oh, shit, shit, shit. Ow. Oh, shit. I've been kind of hoping that, that's, that I would hit him as he hit me, but he's almost dead, so I was like, well, even if I... 
Even if he hits me, it's not gonna kill me, but it will kill him. Like that. Cinders of a Lord, Soul of the Blood of the Wolf. First Lord of Cinder, defeated. That guy was uh, no joke. Yeah, he was he was definitely uh he was definitely tough. Uh so this weapon, the Hollow Slayer sword, um, does extra damage against hollows. And all of these guys are were considered hollows. That's the reason why I was using it. I don't know if it actually did more damage than what my uh sword would have done, but ostensibly it was a good weapon to use against them. The spear that you excuse me. How did this guy die? Did you die because you were fighting the boss and you tried to go down? What the hell are you wearing on your head? I think you died because you were trying to fight the boss. Okay. Uh, what the hell's down here? Is this, like, another area? Oh. Take that as a yes. A mad phantom. Mr. Crow. Mr. Crow. Are you an NPC? Or are you a person? That's the Hollow Slayer sword, so I'm going to assume that you're a person. That dude is very hollow, though, whoever he is. You were... you were AFK. So I'm gonna go on a limb... Okay, so there's another one that just showed up. I think. Maybe not. Maybe not. Uh... Oh. Okay. This looks like a... Honestly, this, look, looks, this looks like a bad place to be. Let's go get this item. Oh, hi. Oh, shit. Glowing eyes. I think that means you're not gonna die. I think that means you're not gonna stay dead. Yeah, you're not gonna stay dead. I don't know what the fuck that was, but I'm leaving. It's time to leave. Time to leave. You have red eyes, so that makes you that means you're like an elite dude. What the fuck just happened there? Ah, you suck. Can't come after me. You're apparently trapped there. So do you you gave me souls, so I'm guessing you You're dead dead. Because you gave me souls. Oh yeah, see that the one dude did disappeared, so So the Mad Phantoms are indeed players. Okay. That's good to know. But your eyes aren't glowing now. What does that mean? Does that mean you're dead? If I kill you again a second time? You gave me souls that time, so does that mean you're dead now? So do you only stay do you only revive once? Yeah, apparently you only revive once. Interesting. Okay, so there's reviving enemies, but they apparently are not endlessly reviving. So this is not like the catacombs, or uh, not the catacombs, but the, um, I don't remember what the hell it was called now, but the, not the, not like the uh, skeletons that were being resummoned constantly in, uh, Dark Souls 1 in that one area. You're more like the... Well, actually, you're even different than that. I was going to say, you're more like the uh, certain enemy... 
I feel like I'm missing a, a sh uh, thing. Although maybe not, because it just lists them, it doesn't. So I guess that's probably everything. So next time we will go, we will return to the Cathedral of the Deep, uh, and we will continue to explore there, because I, that's basically where I need to go next. Um, I am going to go back and Off camera, I might, I might do some some grinding actually before I go back and try to get some more souls, because I want to buy both the uh, Zweihander and that one weapon that I was kind of referring to, but didn't actually tell you what it was. Um, it's it's a weapon that looks interesting. Basically, it's not anything like super interest, super unique or anything. I don't think, but it's a weapon that looks interesting. So I want to go, I want to try it out. Um, they're both 6,000 souls. And I also want to level up some, because I basically want to get my Vigor, my Endurance, and Vitality all to level 20. So I need to have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 levels, uh, which are getting pretty fucking expensive. So I'm actually going to need about 60,000 souls. Well, probably more than that, actually, by the time we do all, all of the 6 levels. Uh, and then... So that will be pretty fucking expensive, uh, in and of itself. But there are some enemies back here in this previous area that are pretty valuable. So I might go try to farm some of them before I return. Uh, so we'll be picking up next episode with whatever it is that ends up... we end up doing. I don't know if these guys are gonna come up and fight them. Also, the summon signs are all gone. Maybe I shouldn't try to engage these guys because the, uh... The wraiths might come up here and try to fight them. And if they do, the wraiths might get killed by these guys again. Uh, which will certainly make my job easier. Well, see, these guys... Th they're not worth that much. These guys aren't, but the uh, there's other enemies around here though, like the wraiths, that actually are worth quite a bit, and the big fucking spell summoning dudes that I hated. Yeah, see they're fighting down there now. So I don't know. I'm gonna level up here a little bit, do some grinding, um, explore the area a little bit more, make sure I didn't miss anything, and uh, we will pick up going to the citadel next time. So I will see you then. Take it easy, folks. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe, and I'll uh, see you next time. Bye-bye.